What time is it? You know what time it is. It's time to hit that subscribe button. And you know just where it's at. Right down there. Go hit it. Go hit it. Go hit it. <laughs> and it's time to find my Instagram on Geekly Amanda. G-E-E-K-L-Y Amanda. It's the same on Twitter. Make sure to follow me there too. And time to get this reaction video started. Raksha Bantan Day. Did I say that right? Rock, Raksha, rock, Raksha Bantan. 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 Well, I think it's a lovely holiday for your brothers and your sisters and you give little thanks to them and little presents. I always thought this was one of the best little holidays. And I wish we had something like that here. We don't. But even my kids, they hardly ever get along. They're teenagers now, but they need a special day to appreciate each other and and give thanks to one another. Maybe I'll make them celebrate today because it's just starting today. I know it's night over there, but it's just starting today. And I got this video here, the history of it to react to. That's my, my thing. We're going to do that today. Y'all ready to check this out with me? Let's go. Oh, I didn't even hit it right. One more time. Let's go. Third time's a charm. That's a saying. Go. <laughs> they didn't want me to play this. That's cute. Is that Mr. Potato Head or Egg? As the month of August arrives, Indians all over the world get anxious to know the date on which Rocky occurs. Rocky lets boys and girls to behold their relation Rocky as brothers and sisters. Rocky. despite of any kinship. The festival of Rakhi has its roots right in the epic of Mahabharata. Sri Krishna has an aunt named Srutha Devi. She gave birth to a deformed child called Sisupala. Elders revealed that Sisupala would be killed by the same person whose touch would bring him back to normality. One day, Sri Krishna came to his aunt's house. As Srutha Devi placed her son in the hands of Krishna, the child turned to be handsome. Though his aunt was happy to look at her kid, she was frowned to know that his death would be in the hands of Krishna. She pleaded Krishna to pardon her child, even if a situation comes where he should be punished. Krishna was moved by her plea and said, I will excuse him for his misdeeds, but I shall certainly punish him if he cross the mark of hundred mistakes. Sisupala has grown up to be the ruler of Chedi kingdom. He is now a ruler and a relative of great Krishna as well. Really? But he used to be very brutal. He used to torture people in his kingdom and clashed with Krishna very often. He once started to abuse Krishna before the whole court. That was it. Sisipala on that day has crossed his limit of that was 100 mistakes. He should... <laughs> and so did the patience of Sri Krishna. Krishna aimed his Sudarshan Chakra at Sisipala. Such was the case when Sisupala has risked his own life despite oh. being warned to be good. As Krishna this charged the Sudarshan Chakra in a range, his finger got cut in the course. Everyone around Krishna has rushed to bring something to tie around the wound. But Draupadi, who was standing there, did not hesitate. She immediately teared a piece from her sari and wrapped it around this. the wound of Krishna's finger. And that's what he Thank you, dear sister. You have come to my rescue in need. So will I help you whenever you are in trouble. I showed Sri Krishna to Draupadi. This incident has led to the ritual of Raksha Bandhan. In later began. times, Krishna indeed kept his word by rescuing Draupadi. When the Kauravas tried to insult her in full court yeah. by dragging her sari. From there upon, sisters were tying Rakhi to their brothers and brothers in Leo would assure to look after their well-being throughout their life. Other than Rakhi, a few more festivals take place on the full moon day in the month of Shravana. Some change their sacred threads called Jandhya on this day. So it's also called as Jandhyala Purnami. People in Orisha and West Bengal place the idols of Radha and Krishna in the cradle and swing them. Oh, Thus they call this day as Julan Purnami. Some states in North India sow the seeds of wheat on this day and they call the ritual as Kajari Purnami. Oh. The people in the states of Kerala and Maharashtra call this day yeah. as Narali Purnami oh. as they worship the sea god. Though many such festivals were celebrated on this day, the prominent one that celebrated all over the country 
without any doubt. Oh, is that's Raksha that Bandha. one. Okay. Look at that. That's the history of it. You know, I many years now I've been reacting to the to, to videos, you know, from India and even the festivals. And I've reacted to some of these in the past, some ad videos and stuff. But now uh, I feel like I can truly, I am understanding. Like before, I wouldn't have known that. I would have been like, oh, Krishna and Indrapati, okay, I've heard those names before. But now understanding the story and and when right when he cut his finger and she went and did it, I was like, that's when in the in the Mahar Mahabharat when he was unraveling on his finger when she they were trying to undress her, and it's all coming together. That's a beautiful story though, and a beautiful like symbolization that you know like a, a sister rapping her brother and taking care of him when he's in need and he promises to always look over her just like Krishna did Drapati. Oh, I love this holiday now. <laughs> this month, one of my favorite holidays. Now I'm, we really need it. <laughs> now we really need it. Now we're going to be celebrating in my house. All right, y'all. Well, happy, happy. What is it? This is for short. Rocky? Rocky? Festival, Rock Eye Festival, happy Rock Eye Day. Let me know what you think. Comments, thumbs, all that. Till next time. Mwah!